What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Trayvon, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Emerald walkthrough. Okay, so as you saw in the beginning, yes, I did capture a Cascoon, because just my luck, I got myself a Silcoon evolving that Wurmple. Yeah, I really thought that I was going to get a Cascoon right there, and then evolved it into a Dustox. Now, there is a very, very logical explanation to all of this. Now, one of the Pokemon in my uh, so-called uh, wish list happened to be Zubat, saying that, you know, hey, you know, I never captured this Pokemon before, but then I realized, like, right there and then, that, wait a minute, dumbass, did you forget about Pokemon Crystal? Did you forget about Toxic Batman? Yeah, I completely forgot about Toxic Batman. So, I had to switch it up. I had to switch it up, and I put in uh, Dustox as my next Pokemon on my team. Yeah, I had to train a buttload of times. I actually had to switch a lot of times. Like, a lot, a lot. Like, so many times, it's just ridiculous. So, let's go ahead and take a look at Toxic Storm right here. I named this Dox, uh, uh, this Dustox Toxic Storm right here. So, as you can see, it has a Shield Dust, Prevents Added Effects, Mild Nature, both Bug and Poison type Pokemon. Uh, it's stats as you can see, you know, it's very speedy very uh, good on the special defense side and all that stuff It's much more of a special attacker than a physical one and it only has two moves Yeah, I didn't need I didn't use a worm bowl or I didn't battle or I didn't get another worm bowl and then evolve it and all that stuff No, I just went straight for the casting and all that stuff But not to worry I will train this Pokemon up to level 13 to get a flying type of attack that way We'll be ready for the next gym battle and as you can see, most of our Pokemon gained a few levels, maybe a level here and there, just because, you know, we've been training this little bastard right here. So, what I'm going to do is, I'm just going to straightforward do this, and we're going to go into Granite Cave and just deal with this. Now, we need the Flash Technique to get through, get, uh, through the Granite Cave, which we will get right about now, right here. If you go in here, talk to this guy, he's like, hey you, it, uh, it, gets, it gets awfully dark here ahead. It'll be tough trying to explore that guy who came by earlier, Steven, I think it was. He knew how to use Flash, and so he ought to be alright. But, well for us hikers, helping those uh, that we meet is our motto. Here you go, I'll pass this along to you. So here we get the, T or the HMO5, which is Flash. It actually lights up any kind of caves and all that stuff. But the cool thing about... Generation 3 is that you know you can actually see a little bit of where you're going so I Really don't want to go into the gym battle right now because we're kind of under leveled right now And I kind of want to explore this place maybe capture another Pokemon on that wish list. You know, I know I know I know I'm well, let me see how many Pokemon do I have right now? I have five Pokemon Don't worry guys. I got this like I said I have I have a wish list of Pokemon that I want on this team or on my on my walkthrough right here. I'm just gonna show a nice amount of Pokemon, you know, that you know kind of covers this whole thing right here. And then at the end, when we're about to take on the Elite Four, yes, I will make sure that I make a very very good team, a very re reinforced team. So as you can see, we're taking on a Makuhita right here. Now let's go ahead and use Toxic Storm right here. Yes, I had Toxic Batman. Now here we have Toxic Storm, and this guy right here knows confusion. Now, I didn't get Toxic Storm just for that attack. I got him for another attack, too. It also has, uh, it, uh, it can also learn Gust Attack, which can be very, very useful against some of the, uh, Fighting-type Pokemon that are, you know, resistant to Psychic-type Pokemon right here. And as you can see, I'm maybe gonna be battling a whole bunch of wild Pokemon while I'm at it, just to train up my Pokemon a little bit. And here we have an Escape Rope, which, well, we will be using later on. So as you can see, Granite Cave. You can get through this place uh, without the Flash Technique. You know, the first por the first portion of the Granite Cave without the Flash Technique because, you know, you can actually see bits and pieces of all these stuff right here. So as you can see, look at that. Would you look at that? Abra. Kind of reminds us of our good old buddy, uh, you know, Ultra Psycho. And you know what? I'm going to be a dick. I'm going to do it. I'm going to capture this Pokemon with two great balls. Let's go. Come on. Stay in that ball. Stay in the ball. Be Ultra Psycho of, of Hoenn. Damn it! Okay. And as you can see, it escapes just like that. Teleport. So, yeah. Not going to do that anymore. And, uh, now there are other portions here in the Granite Cave, which, you know, you will eventually, uh, you will eventually find. Uh, and you probably need the Flash Technique just to see a little bit more of, um... 
And again, like I said, I'm not gonna. I don't really need it right now, just because of you know we're not really gonna go there. We don't have a bike or anything like that. You know? Oh good, this guy Makuhitas. I found the perfect place to train my Toxic Storm and my Ralts. Look at that. Yeah, I am destined to make this Toxic Storm grow levels right now. And uh, as you can see, this is one of the places right here. As you can see, it's just not. It's not letting us go through. So. A little bit later on, we will be, you know, going through there. And would you look at that? Hello, Aron. I've been wanting to see you for a while. Guys, believe it or not, this is the next Pokemon that will be on our team right here, Aron. And, uh, yeah, these attacks are not effective, but look at that. It's confused, and... <laughs> oh, man. Oh, crap. Okay, so... I'm gonna try and capture this R right here. Yes, yes, I know, I know. I'm filling up my Pokemon team too quickly. Again, I said I have a wish list. Eventually, I'm just gonna like, I'm gonna do away with some of the Pokemon that I don't need. What? This is episode nine, and already I filled up my team. Who cares? My walkthrough. I want to do what I want. I know I'll, I'll impress you guys with the team that I will be eventually getting. And uh, come on, hurt yourself. Hurt yourself, you little jerk. Okay. So another confusion attack right here. I'm making things interesting here in the Granite Cave. Let's see. Confused. Hurt yourself. Hurt yourself. Please hurt yourself. Hurt himself. Okay, so we just gotta hit him just a little bit more because Aurons right here are hard to come by, and on top of that, they're very, very, very tough to, to, to just capture with just a with just a uh, what was it called a, a Pokeball. And uh, I'm not gonna take any risk. I'm gonna throw a Pokeball because chances are this guy might hurt himself while I'm trying to capture him. Here we go. Stay in there. Stay in there. Stay in there. Yes! So would you look at that, guys? We caught ourselves our next Pokemon, Aron. The Iron Armor Pokemon. A Pokemon that is clad in steel armor. A new suit of armor is made when it evolves. The old discarded armor is salvaged as metal for making its iron products. Hmm. Look at that. Yes. You know what? I got a perfect name for this Pokemon. I do. It's gonna sound weird, but hear me out. I'm gonna call him this. Dun 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 dun. The Claymore. I'm gonna call him Claymore. Because it's a very, very powerful weapon, guys. A very, very powerful weapon. And of course, Aron, when it finally evolves into the Aron and Agron, very powerful Pokemon. So, welcome to the team, Claymore. That's right. So let's go ahead and take a look at our newest Pokemon, Claymore. So as you can see, it is both a Steel and Rock type Pokemon. It has the Rock Head ability, which means, hello, hello, if you have Takedown, Double Edge, or anything, it won't it won't hit the uh, recoil damage. So that's the kind of Pokemon that I actually wanted on this team right here, the one with the Rock Head uh, technique. As you can see, its speed is not as its greatest attack, or its speed is not its greatest stat right here. Um, very defensive. On the physical side, special defense, not really good. It's more of a physical attacker than anything. And as you can see, it does have a nice move in a headbutt, tackle, hard and mud slap, and all that stuff. And if you would put it in a contest, you know, tough would be its thing right there. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to heal this Pokemon because, you know, who knows if we're going to be using them later on. The or well, the whole episode right here is all about you know these three Pokemon right now: Toxic Storm, Guy, and Shadow. Just to, you know, just to train them. Oh, and let's not forget Shroomly, which I will be training in this whole area right here. So, enough about that. Let's go ahead and you know try and capture or try and get it around this area right here. And, wow, here we have another Aron. So I guess it's easy to find these Aurons. I I don't know. I, I really don't know. Um. You know what, let's go ahead and switch it off. I'm gonna, you know, who cares? I really don't care, guys. Right now, I wanna make this episode a little more interesting. I'm gonna be battling just to gain some more points. As you can see, Shroomly, I, it actually uh, it actually battled quite a few times trying to get this whole Toxic Storm project uh, off the floor. And uh, there's that headbutt. And uh, here we go. Bullet Seed. Oh, God. As you can see, it's very defensive right now. Oh, why did I do that? Why? Okay, I really wanted to go for Absorb, but, you know, I, I have a quick finger, quick triggered finger, you know, if you guys catch my drift, I got 
quick trigger finger and all that stuff. And wow, he's going for all five right here. Look at that. Look at that. Good stuff. And uh, Mud Slap does not work, but it does decrease our accuracy right there. So uh, let's go ahead and just use that Absorb Attack. And, wow, how are you faster than my Pokemon? I want to know. Are we evenly matched? I don't know. And Shroomly misses. Come on, Shroomly. There we go. Oh, come on. It should have defeated him right there and then. Yeah, that... Oh, huh. Well, that's another way to try and capture an Auron. I mean, wow, what are the odds? But I'm not going to capture this guy. I'm just going to use that Absorb Attack. Bye bye, Auron. And uh, everybody gains experience points. That's right. Look at that. Toxic Storm grows to level 11. And Shroomly grows to level 14. Alrighty, alright. So, you know, working hard. And uh, let's see, there's a Pokeball right there. And, uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. I don't think there's any, anything else right here. Nah. Like I said, this place is easy to get by without the, the flash technique, guys. It's really easy. The only things that, the only, re, the only place that you really need a uh, flash technique is, you know, getting up that little hill that, you know, we can't see. And as you can see, another Auron on our way. Not going to battle you. Not going to battle you. I'm sorry. And, uh, wow. So many wild Pokemon. Okay, here we go. Another Abra. You know, you guys know what I'm trying to do right here, right? I'm going to capture this guy. Come on. Let's go. Great ball. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Stay in there. Stay in the ball. Stay in the freaking ball. Oh, God dang it. And uh, there goes Abra. Well, I tried. I really tried. Let's go in here and uh, let's see. Hmm. Hmm. I can't. Rem I don't remember. Really remember this part right here, huh? Yeah. Okay. I really don't remember this part. I only remember bits and pieces of it. Wow. Of the old school one. Because remember, in the, in the new school version of uh, of uh, the Granite Cave, it's not. Oh, there's not a lot that you can find. And wow. So here we have Sableye, a very cool Pokemon. Very very cool Pokemon. And I don't think it will be affected by the move that I was about to use. So. Let's go with Shadow right here. Hmm. I think Shadow can hit it with its bite attack, because it actually knows bite now, since it's, it was doing a switch training. Come on, Shadow. Let's see. I think Sableye is both a ghost and dark type Pokemon, so it's like it really doesn't have any weakness right now. Does it? Hmm. Could be wrong. Here we go. And we're going to go again, and here goes that bite attack. Nearly makes it faint, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna we're gonna capture him. We are going to capture him. Come on. Oh come on, you jerk. So I guess Sableye is another Pokemon that you know uh another Pokemon that needs a great ball to actually capture, you know, that kind of stuff. Very rare Pokemon too in this place. There go. There go. Oh nearly captured this guy. And there's that nightshade attack. Ah, oh, jeez. It's about to make my Pokemon faint right here. Holy crap. Alright. I remember playing Pokemon Sapphire, and, you know, I captured a Sableye just for this reason right here. And, uh, luckily for me, I didn't really put him on my wish list. And, uh, you know what? I'm gonna go with Shroom Lee right here, because I know for a fact this guy's gonna, like, physically attack me. Go ahead. I Oh, you know what? Let's go Stun Sport. Stun Sport. There we go. Okay. Paralysis. I'm making you, I'm making you mine. You are not a legendary Pokemon, so get in this Pokeball. Come on, stay in the Pokeball. Stay in the ball. Stay in the ball. Stay in the ball. That's right. It stayed in the freaking ball. So there we go, guys. Another Pokemon for our collection right there, and I don't even have to go off screen. And as, as you can see, Sableye, darkness Pokemon, it digs branching holes in caves using its sharp claws in search of food. Raw gems, a Sableye lurks in the darkness, is seen only rarely. Huh, darkness. Let's see. You know what, I got the name for it. Here we go. I got the name for this. Dark Conda. Dark Conda. If you guys don't know where that's from, you're too, you're too young. Darkonda from Power Rangers in space.
you know, Power Rangers in Space, one of the greatest seasons ever, you know, that, that stuff. I'm naming him Dark Honda for that reason. And no, I'm not using Sa Sableye on my team. Uh, it's proven to be, it's proven to be a very, very bad Pokemon. And as you can see, this point right here, we can actually find some other stuff. Like, you know, we can use the, uh, what was it called? The Rock Smash technique to find, uh, to find nose passes and all that stuff. We don't have that just yet. And, uh, once we, you know, go a little further, we can actually find, uh, you know, rare stuff. I think there's a, another slide area right here. This place right here is just attacking me with all these Pokemon right now. And, uh, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna run away because I don't want to battle you. Actually, you know what? Let's go ahead and, uh, let's go ahead and use some of those repels, like, we should be using. Because I know some of you guys are getting a little annoyed by that right now, so, move it. Really? Okay, maybe I should switch up my Pokemon just as well. And it looks like we're fighting a lot of female Aurons. Huh, that's, that's kind of fun. That's kind of funny. All right, I guess I'm going to switch right here. Let's go. Nobody's above level 17. Nobody. And uh, there's something right here that we... Oh, here we go. Found ourselves an Everstone, which maybe you guys should know. It's a stone that prevents any kind of evolution don't like it I like to evolve all my Pokemon and uh, let's see I'm trying to find the area right here let's see ah there we go and uh, there we go again and here we are in the very first floor of the granite cave and uh, you know of course we can actually like get out of here real quickly and once you enter this cave there's an individual waiting by and uh, he's like my name is Steven I'm interested in rare stones so I travel here and there Oh, a letter for me. Draven, let Draven handed over the, st the letter. Okay, thank you. You went through all this trouble to deliver that. I need to thank you. Let me see. I'll give you this TM. It contains my favorite move, Steel Wing. And would you look at that? We got a TM 47 Steel Wing. Pretty good move. Your Pokemon appear quite capable. If you keep training, you could even become champion of the Pokemon League one day. Hello, I am the champion. I mean... Two-time champion. I, I, I'm not even going to explain myself. That's what I think. I know since we've uh, gotten to know each other, let's register one another in our Pokenabs. Dun, 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 dun. Look at that. So we got Steven's phone number, and he's like, now i got to hurry along. Okay. Um, alrighty. So that's pretty much it. I, I guess that's it, right? That is it. Okay, so let's see. Steel Wing. Let's see who can learn this move. Obviously... Huh. No shit on me. Shroom or Toxic Batman or Toxic Storm can't learn this move. Well, ain't that a uh, ain't that a kick in the nuts right there. Okay, so I didn't want to do that. And uh, here we have uh, Toxic Batman ready to attack us. He's like, you traitor, you effing traitor. I'm running away. I am running away from this guy right here. And you know what? While I'm at it, before we leave, I might as well put a Toxic Storm in front of us. That way, just in case a Makuhita attacks us or anything like that. And it looks like we're going to go... Yeah, we got out of here scot-free. Wow. Easy peasy, let me squeeze you. Okay, so here we are, Route Sit 106, back to Doofer Town. And we're back right here. So, what we're going to do now, guys, is we're going to take it easy. We're going to take a break. In the next episode, we will be going into the gym. Now, what I'm going to do off screen is I'm going to capture the remaining Pokemon in the, the Granite Cave. And I'm going to train just a little bit, you know, just to get better and all that stuff. So, stay tuned, guys. I'll be back in our next episode of our Pokemon Emerald Walkthrough. See you, guys. <laughs>